Hey guys, for today's video, obviously it is another chat and chill video. I absolutely love filming these because like I said last time, I talk too much. So today's get up, we are in a different location. I got my dog sitting here next to me. So if you see anything moving around in the background, it is him. Also, I'm sorry if you hear traffic, there's a road behind my house. So it is what it is. Hopefully you can't hear that. So it's also very echoey in here because I'm in a big room. So that's okay. I didn't feel like filming in my bedroom today. I wanted to change up the scenery. So, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. Also, I have no direction for this video, so sometimes those are the best videos or the worst. You know, either or. I really, I really don't know where this video is going to go. So, it's 3 o'clock. I've got my second cup of coffee, and I'm going to be up until probably 4 in the morning. But, you know, it's okay. I'm vlogging today. My vlogging camera is charging right now currently, so it is also a very gloomy, overcast, cloudy day. So, yesterday was really sunny and 40 degrees, so it was like... A godsend from heaven that we finally got a warm day because the day before it was like 20 and super strong winds I'd started training this week so I had a lot of work training and um, med training to pass meds to clients and that is what I've done this week so I've been exhausted my parents are currently on their way to Cosmo Mexico so they'll be there for nine days and then we're going back next month so I'm so excited oh my friend Taylor Shrum uh, here on YouTube if you guys haven't seen her on YouTube definitely go check out her channel I'll link it in the description box she did a video talking about her like travel bucket list for 2017 so I want to talk about that too I think that was such a great video idea because traveling is seriously my favorite thing to do so this year I am going to Nashville and Cozumel like I've said in a million and five videos that I'm going there but I'm so excited I would also like to go back to Georgia this year my mom's friend lives there so we like to go visit her all the time we hike Kennesaw Mountain or Mount Kennesaw I don't really know how I think it's Mount Kennesaw or Little Kennesaw I don't know if you know correct me but um, we did that last year and it was so much fun I wish I had vlogged it because it was seriously so beautiful um, when I went down there I was like so convinced that after I get my degree I'm gonna go move to Georgia and live there by myself life happens and that definitely did not happen last year so 2017 is here it's been an okay year I guess so far but you have to be optimistic with everything or as optimistic as possible at least that's how I look at it so it's only February we have 10 more months to go also I would like to go to I'd like to go to Seattle and like the Seattle area I want to go to San Francisco because I think it's a little more um there's more to do and more to see and while you can go to like the beachy areas which I love the beach and everything I would rather go to like a Florida beach or um, North Carolina or South Carolina or somewhere like that I would also like to go back to New York City this year I went two summers ago on a really spontaneous last-minute trip with my mom and her friends and that was so 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 much fun I actually came down with like severe bronchitis when I was there it was horrible I literally completely lost my voice and I would try to talk to people like if I was buying something at a store and they would be like what did you say like can you repeat yourself I can't even hear you like I literally had to like push on my throat to get any voice out so I didn't really enjoy New York that first time just for the fact that it was so hot it was like 90 degrees and then if you've ever been to New York you know there's no wind and it's a concrete jungle so it's seriously so hot so also I would like to go to Vegas I did go to Vegas when I was young and obviously like my mom took me and my uncle had a timeshare there, so that's why we went, but my parents were never big Vegas people anyway. I think their opinion on Vegas kind of like rubbed off on me, so that's kind of like why I've been always turned off by Vegas. But I would like to give it another chance and actually go myself as an adult and see how I like it. But um, it's very expensive to go to Vegas, and I'm not a huge gambler. So I would like to go for the shows and everything. I think it's a very touristy spot. Vegas is not a, a place that's on a very high priority, but I mean, it's a place that I would like to go to. I would like to visit Arizona again. I went when I was a sophomore in high school. We visited my grandmother and a grandfather. I don't know why I said that. <laughs> we visited my grandparents and they live in like the Mesa area, I believe. So that was a lot of fun. I wish we would have gone hiking and stuff because I know they have some really cool hiking trails around there. So maybe one day but not anytime soon i just kind of like word vomit right now thank you guys so much for 420 subscribers um from the start of my channel i never would have thought that i would have even hit over 100 or even over 10 i guess but i think it's just crazy how 
the internet works and how people can literally find your channel so simply. Um, I know I had like an old sorority sister who had found my channel like very in the beginning stages and I, I was so embarrassed. I was like seriously now I want to delete all my videos and this was back in like um, September probably and like here I am I'm still posting every week like I haven't stopped so I'm really excited to see where the future holds with my YouTube channel and I'm just very proud of myself for starting this because I wanted to do it literally since I was in 8th or ninth grade. I did start channels back then but I always deleted the videos because I didn't want people from my school to find me. Also um, I would love to film more like travel videos so like I was talking about the places that I want to travel I want to do kind of like travel diaries I did one when I was in Minneapolis but I was too scared to vlog there and like actually talk and do fun things so I only had like a few clips very few clips I should say but that video turned out okay like I'm I'm not good with editing yet and I was still editing on Windows Movie Maker at the time now I have upgraded to iMovie finally but so I don't know what else to say also, if you guys have upgraded to the new iOS 10, I think it is, the new keyboard clicks are like the best noise ever. And if you guys watch Alicia Marie's vlogs, she does this thing with her makeup where she like sets it down. And I know a ton of vloggers do this, but this is the specific example that I have in mind. But she'll like take her makeup out of the caddy and then set it down on the um, counter and it'll make like this clicking noise. And it's like very repetitive and that noise is just like... Ugh, to me I can't stand it I have to skip over that part because I literally it's like cringe like nails on a chalkboard I hate it it's just funny how like some noises bother people so badly and some don't like chewing when I can hear someone chewing oh my god I know everyone chews like it's fine but it's just like a very big pet peeve of mine I just don't like it Alright, so at the end of these videos, I want to answer random questions, whether it's from you guys or from ones that I pull up. A lot of you guys ask questions, and I'll just answer them in the comments, like, where's your shirt from? How do you curl your hair like that? Stuff like that. But if you have very, like, specific questions, I will answer them in the next video. If it's, like, a very random question that you want me to answer, please ask it. I feel like we should call it something. Um, let's do, like, questions for next time and then ask your questions. If you have a question, you don't have to, but I'm just going to look them up right now and then... Yeah, so I'm gonna scroll through these 800 random questions and stop. What is your favorite flower? I really like daisies and like sunflowers. I think they're really pretty. I actually wanted to get a tattoo of a daisy. Um, I have two tattoos on my back and one on my ribs, so I wanted to incorporate it somehow in those. So I guess we'll see. I don't really have any intentions on getting it soon, I guess, but it was just a thought, so. <laughs> Do you own any inflatable furniture? Wow, that's an interesting question, but no, I do not. Um, I feel like I totally remember back in like the 90s or like the late 90s, early 2000s, they probably had like blow up couches. I feel like that was a thing. What is your favorite party game? I really like Heads Up. I really like um, Cards Against Humanity because you know, who doesn't love that game? Um, I'm trying to think what else. That's all I can really think of right now. I also like the drinking games that people play at parties and stuff, that's fun. You are walking to work. There is a dog drowning in a canal on the side of the street. Your boss told you if you were late one more time, you're fired. Do you save the dog? Hell yeah, if you don't save the dog, you're, what? You can get another job, that dog can't get another life. <laughs> have you ever had chicken pox? Yes I have, and I also had the chicken pox shot. Well, that, my voice kind of cracked there. <laughs> like a teenage boy. But yes, I've had the chicken pox and I had the chicken pox shot. So I still got the chicken pox even with the vaccine, so that really sucks. But actually, if I don't know which side of my nose it's on. I have like a divot in one of the sides of it. Um, I don't know which one it is, but that's a chicken pox scar, whatever side it is. I'm sure you can see it. <laughs> so that is everything for today's video. If you guys like these videos, please let me know because I want to keep continuing to film them. That didn't really make sense, but whatever. So if you guys have any topics of what you would like me to talk about for the next chat and chill, leave them in a the comment and I will probably talk about them because, you know, I've probably been talking for 30 minutes. Honestly, it's probably been 30 minutes. So I will see you guys in my next video. Make sure to follow me on social media. The links are always posted below. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. What the hell? There's a bug. Uh.
good. My dog's looking at me like I'm a psycho. Wait, that's because I am. 